Mexican food that I like to have. I agree with you, but why are we here? Oh, yeah. This is where ghost trackers eat before they went on their investigation, right? This right. Is like they're on their way. Poor Cole. Cole was having a little bit of a... An issue. He was having, he was having an issue. <laughs> He's a little hungover. Oh, yeah, man. Eat them beans. Beans and rice. Are you serious? Mixing them together, having a party in that stomach. Are you serious? <laughs> you puke. I want to catch it on camera. Are you kidding me? Maybe a little web series out of it. Just Stop, Cold. Yeah, but hey, what's better? I know, right? When you're a little homeowner. So, actually, they were sitting at that table right there. And, because you can see the background here, you can see this thing up here. And you can see the bar over there. Dukes, the untold story. Mark, cut it out. Why? I can do a little spin. Why not? Would you stop? It's, it's annoying. Is it? You're being oh, obnoxious. You're the stop little, filming. You're looking over our little dossier. Yeah, yeah, I'm actually Evil doing... awaits us, huh? S turn off the fucking camera, Mark. Let's watch her eat. Marcel, you're being obnoxious. <laughs> Hello? Turn the fucking camera off. Turn it off. And then while they were eating, a couple yeah, came over yeah. that enjoyed their show. Yeah. And they would have been standing like right here, but yeah. you can see that in the background. I just gotta tell you, my wife and I are such big fans of your show. Oh, huge yeah. fans. Thank, Thank you very much. We have your entire first season on DVD. Really? Oh, wow. really? So yeah, it's a cool place. I can't even pronounce it, but like she said, we'll put it in the description. Yeah, and it's amazing. If you're ever in, the, in this area, Piermont, we're in Piermont, New York. If you're ever, right? If you're ever in this area, mm -hmm. you gotta come here. We're gonna put the uh, description the right link. down below. Yeah, the link. we'll put it. Yep. Yep, we'll let you know where it's at. It's amazing. Okay, you guys, we were just up in Tequila Sal y Limon, a uh, fine Mexican restaurant. Let me tell you, that was amazing. It's been a minute since I've had authentic Mexican food. It was so amazing. I loved it too. But actually, we're here because this is the two of the filming locations. So, you know, we just showed you Tequila Sally Limon, but there's also the turning point, which was the bar where the ghost trackers went to celebrate before uh, they had their investigation. Hey, either way, the pretzels were delicious. <laughs> okay. I don't want to pay for anything tonight. But well, I'm... come on, you're $100 richer. <laughs> Yeah. Barky. Another round. Barky. You can't Barky. 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 <laughs> Why would you be able to Just twist your arm all the way around? Oh my god! Ew, ew, ew. Uh, oh, ew, ew, ew. Ew. No, no, no. Everybody was drinking but Sam. I wonder why. I wonder she wasn't why. Drinking. Yeah, I wonder and why. You know what else? Why would somebody not drink? I wonder why. why? Yeah. Oh yeah, Boy, same, same I thing. Look about Looks the same. Nine months. <laughs> about nine months pregnant after eating that food. <clears throat> Yeah, I know, right? But anyway, the pretzels were delicious. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> we can't go in. Barkeep. <laughs> hey, barkeep. So, yeah. Anyways, the bar doesn't open till 7, yeah. and it's a long time before it's 7, so. Yep. So, we're not going to, we can't show you inside, but that's definitely where the bar, mm -hmm. and that's definitely where the restaurant scene is, so. Yep. So check out the movie and you'll be able to see both of these scenes that we just showed you. Yep, and it's in Piermont, New York. That's right. Let's take a walk And by here. the way, what a great city little town this is. Look at it. It's just beautiful. I just love it. It is a cute little town. <clears throat> Can't really see too good, but the bar is in there. Here, let me see over here. Maybe you can see better. They were at the bar there eating the pretzels and stuff. JM Explorations, 500th episode. Lunch with the lunch. Camera A, camera B. Let's go. This is Ghost Trackers, episode 100, Hillcrest Sanatorium. Camera A, camera B. All right, I'm rolling. All right, so we're at the um, Westgate Inn in Nyack, New York. And this is where the ghost trackers stayed um, the night before they left for Hillcrest Sanatorium. Yep. So this is the exact spot that they were standing in. Their van was parked right here. And you know, they were like 
super excited. Yeah, of course. Wouldn't you be? <laughs> they were like super excited. And hey, as you can see, we are packing up for what is sure to be one of the most exciting investigations we have ever done. The location we're going to is shrouded in so much secrecy and lore that we're pretty sure we're in store for one heck of a night. Yeah. We're the lucky bastards that get to go in first. Oh, shit. Can you blame them? Uh, you can't blame them one bit. Nope, so we just wanted to show it to you. Yep, and we're parked exactly where the van was. That's right, because we're awesome. Yep. <laughs> As you can see, there's no J&M logos on the car yet, but maybe soon. Maybe soon. Yep, so they would probably would have stayed over here somewhere, yeah, I would guess. One of these, one of these rooms yeah. over here, so. We, did, we don't have any interior shots, but they did film the interior of the motel rooms. We did, right that's here. right, and we didn't stay here, so. Yeah. You won't have any interior, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh boy, there oh, she boy. is. That's a big one. Yeah, this is gonna be our Stanley Cup. <laughs> Sanatorium is a movie by Brant Serson. If you guys haven't checked it out, check it out. It's from 2013. Yep. And I, you know, people ask us all the time, what do you, what's, what's a movie that you think deserves a little more credit? Yeah. This one definitely does. This is it, you guys. It's in 1955, Richard Howell, a patient yep. at the sanatorium, yep. murdered three, three children, children yes. ages eight to 11. And then he killed himself. He hung himself. He hung himself. Hanged. Hanged, he hanged, hanged himself. himself. Right, right, right. <laughs> he hanged himself yep. in a room in this hospital. Yes, right back there. So we're doing a filming locations for you we guys. We are. So so. Uh, so the outside shots of this movie were shot here. You know, and most of you know what this building is. And um, across the street is where they shot so all the inside scenes so uh we're going to show you both that's but, right uh, i'm excited it's cold but whatever i it can't is feel my is. ears no snow on the ground that's a good no, thing no but that's what the movie so the movie takes place on new year's eve correct and uh the characters are sam and tyler they're a married couple yep and they're oh she's gonna have a little baby yep <laughs> she's gonna have a little baby and then we got um mark and cole they're like the goofy goofballs yep. And then we've got Bridget, who yep. is sort of like she she's man, a tech. She's, she's a tech. tech. She mans and watches. She mans all the equipment. So they're all cool. We're gonna go to some of the uh, outside locations as well, and we can't wait to bring it to you guys. Yep. So let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yes. We're at Lakewood. Okay. So they first come up here. This is where the movie starts, right? We sort of kind of yep. gave you that preview. Yep. They and drive up there. Drive right up. Right here. up here, and they. Right. Meet Irwin. They're gonna meet Irwin. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, that's it. It looks uh, pretty creepy, like we thought it would. This is a big one for us. This is like our Super Bowl. This place is famous. Oh my God. You see wow. it's boarded up? Check this. That's Irwin. That's Irwin. Uh, he just set this all up for us. Irwin is the caretaker, and he knows everything that goes on here. And don't try to F with him, because he will mess you up. That's right. So, Irwin meets them over here. Irwin. Yeah, I'm Irwin. Hey, we're, uh, right. we're the ghost trackers. I know who you guys are. <laughs> I watched your show. Oh, uh, we were hearing that. Me. I think they parked their van somewhere right around here for the first day. They come the first day. They're here on December 30th to start. And they're just sort of checking the place out. Shit, you got it. not allowed to go in and Irwin's gonna make sure that they don't go in. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you're gonna get a little preview here. So, uh, watch the class. Oh, <laughs> no, man, go, go, go. Oh, Jesus Christ! Mark. 
You weren't trying to go in there, were you? No, man. Okay, deal's a deal. No, I got you, dude. Okay, you go in today, I lose my job. <laughs> I got you, man. We're just taking a peek. That's We're all. Going We're in going tomorrow. in tomorrow. Be a good boy. All right. I okay, will. you're the man. Fucking asshole. Okay, so this this is it. This is this is where they're gonna get their little preview. For those of you who know this place, you will recognize it very well. And um, so this is where they're gonna get a little preview. Erwin um, is standing over here, out of the way. They're trying to weasel their way in before they're supposed He's to. Right there by those steps. That's where they preview, right through the door there, or through the window. Hey, hey be cool. Everyone's right over there. Give you a little preview. Be a good boy. <laughs> okay, you guys, so many things were filmed in, with this as the um, backdrop. Of course. I mean, can you imagine a better backdrop than this? No. This is the, this is our love. This is, this hospital is just our love. So. Of course, it would be better if the sun wasn't in a shot, but whatever. Yeah, sorry, sorry about that. So, first and foremost, one of the creepiest scenes, uh, they're, they're not even in yet. It's still December 30th. They're checking the place out. They're standing out here and talking with each other. And what do we see, Marcel? We see a little kid in the window. I think tonight, during our investigation, I'm going to be dedicating everything hey, I can. Hey, man, wait, 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 hold on, man. What? what? There's something in the window. What? There was something in that window. I... It looked, like a, it looked like a little kid. There was something. There's a little in kid that, in the window. There was something okay. in that window. There was a kid in that okay, window, get man. This. Get this. Oh my god. I'm gonna show you right up <laughs> so here. Creepy. It's hard to see because there's uh, the trees in the way, but yes. it's right up in that window over there somewhere. The scene was so well done in the movie. You have to like kind of actually replay it a couple of times and really get up there to see. The little boy's face, but sure enough, I think it's a little boy, you can right? You see it on the bigger screen. Yeah, it's a yeah, little boy. Yeah, it's a ghost boy. Yeah, and it's creepy. So, yeah. When I, in fact, when we're here, I always feel like he's staring at us. Yeah, he might be. Yeah. <laughs> yep. So, another scene that was also filmed here. Uh, obviously, this is where they go in. So, you guys can come over here. Yeah. Well, this is where they show you that they're going in, but the inside shots were not shot here, so. Watch your stepping. I kind of plowed earlier when before you guys came a little bit, not plowed, but I kind of stomped it down. I'm ready to go in, you ready to go in? Let's go. Yeah. Okay. All right. You're all over 18, right? Okay. Most of us, yeah. Okay, ready? Here we go. Might be a couple of rats, but don't worry. Okay. Right. But here, I'll walk up here. <clears throat> right, right here. You can see that it's boarded up. So, but this is where they go upstairs and, you know, where Erwin turns around and says, hey, you all 18, right? <laughs> I'm like right on the border. Yeah, right. I'm like exactly. right on the border. Yep. He wants to make sure they're all legal to go in. So. Yeah, of course. You know? He doesn't take any crap. <clears throat> Shout out to DJ Hazard if he ever sees this. Yeah. Yeah, great, great job is Erwin. Yep. So uh, also, this is the scene where, oh my God, you guys, Mark and Sam have made it out of the building. They're about to escape this terror that's on the inside. Their van is parked here. Just about somewhere right around here. Yeah, right here, yeah. And they're just like, oh, they're about out of here. Like, they're going to go get help. Their friends are still inside, but God knows what's happened to the friends. But out comes Tyler. 
out of the door here. Yep. Standing right at the entrance. Now Tyler is Sam's husband. I'm not trying to do spoilers here, but I want you guys to watch this movie. But Tyler comes out and Sam's like, my husband. P.S. Kate, what an amazing actress. Yeah, she's, she's good. They're all great. Like, they're just amazing. But Kate does an excellent job. Anyway, come right out. She sees her husband and she's like, I gotta go back in. Tell me, just go! <laughs> That's my husband and I can't What are you doing? I don't know. Go! I don't know what to do. I don't care for shit, go! That's right. Wait, 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 wait! wait. wait. Tyler! Tyler! Sam, no, no, no Sam! Tyler. Sam, go! So she runs back in and then that's about where R.I.P. Mark. Spoiler alert. Yeah. Right. He, Marco's dragging away somewhere. Yeah, but I think he's like gonna chase after. He's trying to keep her safe, but he don't make it. No. <laughs> All right. Spoiler, but please watch it, guys. You'll love it. <laughs> Tyler. <laughs> 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 Okay, so in the movie, Irwin is telling us the story about how this room was also used as the autopsy room or the morgue um, back when it was used as a sanatorium. So they were talking about how there were sinks over here and how they would lay the bodies out. And so, um, of course, Tyler is like, oh, this is where the bodies were dissected. So anyway, this is, that, that's, this is where they were walking, right here. During the nursing home period, this was, as you might be able to tell, was, was the kitchen, you know, stoves, ovens, sinks. But before that, this exact same room, back in the sanatorium days, was the autopsy room in the morgue. What? Yeah. So we're talking a lot of bodies in this room, a lot of people who went through probably horribly traumatic deaths. And this is where they were stored. This is where they were dissected. Yeah. Come in here. Get in here. Get in here. It's like, you feel it? It's like, it's like 20. It's cold. It's like 20 degrees colder in here. Do you feel it? Feel that? Is anybody else's limbs hurting? Does anybody else feel that? Anybody? Anyone? <laughs> I think it's just because it's cold out. Because it's winter. Because <laughs> it's winter. <laughs> it's, good, and it's just because it's winter. Tyler, come in here. Feel this. It's like 20 degrees colder in here than in there. It's freezing in here. It's freezing in here. Cole, get in here. It's definitely, it's, it's noticeably colder in this room. This place is evil. Anybody else's limbs hurt right now? Like my limbs, like my elbows, my joint, you know, right? Yeah. Between you and me, I think it's just cold because it's, it's winter. You know? Yeah. Anyway, I find, I, we're just playing around because that's pr part of the movie. And I think this room is super creepy. It is creepy. And I want to know what, 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 why, why is this room here? It's creepy. Creep factor 10. Love it. it concludes the tour. Sorry. No gift shop. <laughs> <laughs> we can't thank you enough. Yeah, thank thanks, everyone. So it's amazing. great, it's man. I appreciate amazing. it. Thank you, um, guys. Okay, this is where they were shooting that little outside scene. Erwin was talking. You see, he was standing like right over here. You can tell those two windows. Boom, boom. That was right there. And those. And definitely that railing. building so we're in the building oh this is so cool recognize this from the movie you know what we've got here Ooh.
Yeah, they show, so they show this shot in the movie. Right here. You can see by this, uh, this little graffiti over here. Gonna need it in some places. Oh yeah, I remember this bathroom when they walked in here. Therapy tub. Front's caving in a little bit over there, so and this stairway right here when poor Samantha getting dragged down the stairs by the entity. Oh, this is, this is where they set up. This is the room where they set up their equipment. I think their table was right there. This thing right here was covering the uh, heat. Let's put it back there, where it goes. How about that? Make it look uh, authentic. See? Is that shot was from back here? You're gonna see their table was right here. That was behind Bridget. Along with those hooks. So our cameras are all set up. We've got this whole place covered. We've got the kitchen. We've got every hallway, the children's wing. We've got um, outside in front. We've also got motion detectors in Howell's room, the children's wing. And there's also one right behind me so that Mark doesn't pull a single thing. Thank you, Bridget. Uh, we've got a great opportunity here to capture some really good activity in this building. Let's break up into teams. Sam and I are gonna be one team, and of course, Mark and Cole another. Bridget's gonna stay here, monitor all our activity. Let's do this, guys. One, two, three. Lights, Lights out! out! But this hallway right here was really important because, well, you see this a few times in the movie, but 
at the end, when Samantha is walking through, sorry, she'll come down this hallway with her knife right here into this room. Tell by that curtain, the curtain moves behind Samantha. It's crazy, right? Like it keeps changing. Whoa! What? 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 Uh, the curtain just moved. What do you mean the curtain just moved? I mean the curtain moved, Sam. child things around. This might have been the chair from the movie. Looks like it. It is warm over here. It's warm. What is that? What is that? It's here. Yeah, it's here. shot right here. This is when Bridget's setting up some uh, uh, motion detectors. She sets them up right, right here and right here. So if you walk across, because you can see the brown wall in the background there. So these are motion detectors. If any mass or energy passes through, an alarm will sound. Oh, 
this is where Richard Howell hung himself. Right there, this is the room. And you can tell because if you come right here, you see this door right here. Oh, that is so awesome. So he was right up there? Yeah, right up there where the plaster's missing. That crazy light wasn't there back there, but they came in and found him dangling right from that spot there. I know you can hear us, Richard Howell. I know you're watching us right now. I can feel you. You did that to those kids, Richard? You did that to those kids? Try that on me. Try that on me. Come on, Richard. Where are you? I'm waiting for you. Come push me around. You want to push little kids around? Come push me around. I'm a grown ass adult. Richard, are you here? I know you suffered a lot while you lived here, and you had a hard life, but what you did to those kids, that was unacceptable. We're about to descend down to the passage to paradise. Start our investigation. Here we go. All right. Oh, dude, it smells so bad. When they're walking through, when he gets the spider on his face, I think it's right here because he recognizes this water tank over here. Oh, ah, dude, you, what? You, what? You, what? Shit! 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 Oh, fuck, spider! Spider up! Spider, spider, spider up! Dude, there's a spider on me. There's a spider on me. Get off my face! Get off my face! Get off my face! Have a spider on your face! There you go. Got it. You okay? Okay. Yeah, can you make it? Fuck you, dude. All right. So when Tyler and Sam, their team, investigators, of course, in the movie, you see them come in over there, and they'll come through, and that's when they see the orb, you know, and they have Bridget check the, yeah. you know, the, cam the cameras and stuff to make sure. The method of Bridget? Go ahead, Sam. Hey, can you roll back the kitchen feed about a minute or so and tell us if you see or hear anything? You got it. Copy, thanks. Um, that's one scene here. and There's a couple other scenes that walk through, but whatever. The, the main scene at the end, yes. when Sam is like the only one left, she comes running through here. And it's so cool how the ceiling's all falling in yeah, above I her. So. Yeah. Well, she's running right through here. I think when we first entered into this room, I was blown away. I was like, oh, it yeah. looks exactly it the looks, same. Look at it. It looks exactly the same. It looks the same. roof. Yep. See, sorry, the ceiling. 100%. Now, you guys, this is my, oh, I have a real phobia. We're heading towards my fear.
what they say what like your fear is is maybe a way that you died in your past life. Yeah. That's very far. Oh, sorry. Look at this glass. That's so cool. <laughs> Not in the movie. Still cool. Yeah. All right. Right? Where did you baby here? Nice. I think you do it better. Do you guys yeah. remember that scene? Please tell me that you've seen this movie because if you haven't, you need to watch it. You missed out if you haven't. We, we highly recommend it. So this is where, well, one of the scenes takes place where he's standing. They're like just joking around. They're like doing their walk around. And they're just checking out like the places they're going to investigate in the evening. And so they're in here. And they're like messing around. They're like taking pictures of each other. And, all of a sudden, this like shadow hand comes out. It's like my favorite part of this movie are the little subtle scares. And so. You wanna get some promo stuff? I got my camera here. Yeah. All right. Good idea. All right, hold on. Yeah, there you are. Give me any more face. All right. Dude. Dude, dude, what? What? Yeah, I really like that part. Now, this move, this room was also used for the demise of one of the characters. There he is. He's in the freezer room. He's in the freezer room. <laughs> right. R.I.P. Yes. R.I.P. Cole. Yep. And when we got here, I was like so oh, excited because let's go look. Let's go look. Oh, I don't know if we can see it. Mm -hmm. I don't have to turn the light on let's turn light to on. see it. So hold on. Yeah. Check it out. Can you see it? I don't know if you, I can't tell if you can see it or not. All right. Anyway, it's the blood. There it is. Now it's I can cold. see it. I shut the infrared off. Infrared? No infrared. Infrared? Remember that? Oh yeah, no infrared. <laughs> but yeah, look at the blood still there. This one? This one, you're sure? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's not oh. here. He's not here. What is that? What do we want? Get out of the way. What is that? Oh, oh my god. Oh. Hi. Hey, good job quoting the movie. <laughs> Thank you. That's a great scene. They're like showing how dark it is. They're like in the dark. Yeah. Rest in peace, Cole. It's closer in. <laughs> no, it's my nightmare. It legit is my nightmare. All right. What next? Let's move. Let's go this way. All right, let's go. So this room was used in the scene where they're actually doing some investigating and they are walking around and they're stopping because they're starting to hear, not the sound of the car. <laughs> <laughs> they're starting to hear sounds, right? This is where they're, they're starting to hear, okay, something's going on here. So they pan over, they start walking this way. First of all, you can see that in the background. I just want yeah. to show like that right there, the air conditioner and that window. It's Tyler and Samantha. We're in the dining room, headed towards the kitchen. And they walk over this way. They actually, he turns his camera and points it over there, and I can see in the shot, whatever's, it's behind this, this, like, whatever that is. Yeah. See it? That's in the shot as well. Yeah, oh, and that, right?
Forget about it. So that is how we know. Yep. And those wonderful curtains. Hmm. Oof. Those are some old curtains. Yeah, they are. But aside from the movie, this is kind of a cool room. Yeah. The dining room. And she mentions that. She mentions that in the movie. That this she is, does, yeah. This is the dining room. <laughs> Okay, so you guys, Marcel, he went off to go to the bathroom. You know, he had to take a pee. And uh, so I like, I'm like, where is he? I'm walking around just trying to check out the place. And I um, came over here and check it out. He's crazy. He's absolutely crazy. Oh shit. So, uh, so Cole and I are walking around the perimeter just scouting things out, and then uh, we discover our boy, uh, Erwin, over here. I thought he was taking a piss. He's just talking to no one. Absolutely no one. Or, maybe he's talking to a demon. Dude, seriously, this guy's out of his mind. He's crazy, man. What's he doing? 